Well, tonight we continue to honor and recognize people who served in our U.S. military. Earlier today, even in the rain, hundreds of people gathered in downtown for the Veterans Day Parade. 10 News reporter Jacinta Render was there and tells us what today means to people who served our country and to those who are grateful for our troops. Jacinta. The Veterans Day Parade has been happening in Knoxville for nearly 100 years. People from all over East Tennessee gathered on Gay Street for this year's event. The rain did not stop people from coming out. Some had umbrellas in one hand and the American flag in the other. It gives me it gives me goosebumps uh, just uh, seeing everyone out here. Um, we just absolutely love the veterans. We love to support them, love that they fought for our freedom. Some people came to the parade to fellowship with other veterans and others came to show their support. We've gone every year ever since my kids were little. Veterans Day officially became a U.S. holiday in 1954. People in Knoxville started celebrating veterans way before then, launched by the American Legion Post 2. This is Knoxville's 97th Veterans Day Parade. See the turnout for everybody that came out is really great. Even in the rain, marching bands from local schools performed. And veterans from all branches of the military waved to the crowd from their vehicles. For many, the national holiday is a time to remember relatives who served and to recognize those who are keeping family traditions going. Both my grandfathers were Air Force vets and now I have a daughter that is in the Air Force and serving our country. One veteran says while it is nice to see people show gratitude, this is also a day to reflect. Without getting too emotional, I've lost a lot of friends in the time I was in, so it's, it's a time to honor them. 85 parade units were at this year's event and also new Air Force recruits were sworn in during the parade. Beth. Great tribute. Thank you so much, Jacinta, for sharing.